Welcome back, Maxwell Smooth. You're listening to Smooth and Crypto. You have been absolutely smashing the subscribe button. We're at 313. I'm so blessed and thankful for every single one of you guys. And we're on the road to 500 subscribers. We got a giveaway, a Rack Hotspot Miner. It mines helium, great price, great value, free. You just have to subscribe to my channel, uh, follow me on Twitter, and then DM me your, your YouTube name and you're all good. So today, what we're going to talk about is I have a comment uh, from a video just asking me a couple questions, and I feel like it'd be a good little short video to, to talk about. So he says, are there any better tips you could give or a video you've already made which you could indicate me? What is a good position to strive for? So in my mind, in the Pulse, PulseX ecosystem, almost anything is a good entry point, a good position to have. What I would say is I could see both going to a dollar in my opinion. So if you get in whenever you get in and you do some math and how many coins you need to make that happen that you'd be good at one dollar then that's the position i'd i'd go for everybody has a different position in in mind when they think about financial freedom or or return on this stuff so i'm in it till one dollar plus so that's kind of how i view it just however many coins you need to make that happen then then you're good should you buy Hex or wait until Pulse Chain releases to buy the other tokens? I'd buy Hex now uh, if if I were in the same shoes because uh, I think it's going to pump before release and it's going to be the most liquid on the chain at first. So I'd buy now and you know put some stakes in and get those copied over as well. Um, so I don't know what the price of P Hex is actually going to be at start. Um, but the amount of coins is still going to be the same. So you can do almost anything you want with those coins that you get, uh, or you can just put it all in staking. So how do you see Hex performing versus the other tokens in the ecosystem? So Richard Hart is making Pulse Chain for Hex. So he is taking his original baby and making it on a better blockchain to make that thing do better. I think Hex is going to perform super well. I have no idea ETH Hex versus P Hex, uh, Pulse Hex, which one's going to do better. Um, or if they go to price parity or, or what may happen. Um, a lot of unknowns in that, but I could still see uh, Hex performing very well in the ecosystem on Pulse Chain. Um, why am I so bullish on this ecosystem? First of all, the tokenomics of Pulse Chain and PulseX and Hex, the guy who is making these things is in it for everybody's well-being. And when you have the tokenomics to absolutely moon something and make it a great project and you have the community behind this ecosystem, that is a very, very, very good combination of things. This community is so awesome and so you know bullish on this stuff that they're not going to let it die and they are going to hold and they are going to do everything that they can to make this ecosystem work and i think that's why i'm so bullish it's the community and the tokenomics and richard hart is just an absolute beast as well so it's uh those three things on why i'm so bullish on this ecosystem um, none of this is financial advice, of course, um, but I really appreciate you guys. Um, just a little quick video on some some random questions that a, uh, a subscriber had for me. We're doing the giveaway at 500 subscribers, the Rack Hotspot Miner, and all you got to do is subscribe to me, follow my Twitter, DM me your YouTube handle, and uh, yeah, you're in. So... This has been Smooth and Crypto. I'm your host, Maxwell Smooth, and uh, we're, we're back at it uh, again tomorrow. So have a good night, guys.